We're continuing to have discussions with utilities. We've had a lot of discussions face-to-face, -face, telephone, and uh, we will keep doing that. There's a lot of interest in South Carolina. I mean, South Carolina is booming. Everybody knows it all over the country and all over the world. And the chance for these utilities to, to get a stake in South Carolina is, is a very attractive thing to them. The question is, uh, what will be the price and uh, how, how could it all be worked out? But one thing's for sure. Uh, my goal is to see to it that the reactors are built, if they're not built, then the, the people that put money into it need to get their money back. And number three, we need to we need to have plenty of power in South Carolina. Without power, we, we can't grow economically. And number four, there's a national security interest in this because there are other countries that are moving right ahead with nuclear power. We do not want to take ourselves out of the nuclear power business. Uh, we, we must have nuclear power for the future. How would selling uh, some or all of Santi Cooper's assets uh, help customers who have already spent or paid billions toward, toward these projects? Well, that may be the source of some money to co go back to those people who have paid that money. That is the customers of Santee Cooper. You sell the assets of Santee Cooper, if it, some or all or some combination there, uh, that would be the source of funds to repay those and that would assume that the reactors are not going to be built. But all options are open. We haven't taken anything off the table. Uh, we are having discussions with major companies who have major interests and it's, uh, we, we, we're working on it uh, every day. Who then would assume the Santee Cooper's $8 billion in debts, four of which are tied to the nuclear project? Well, that's the, the, assuming that debt would be a part of the structure of, of a sale or an agreement. Uh, it could be numerous companies. It could be a company. And of course, uh, Santee Cooper has debts, but it also has assets. So that, again, everything is, is in play. There are no options uh, that have been taken off the table. How, how closely are you talking with House and Senate leaders? How, how closely are they tied in with these negotiations? I've been keeping them abreast of our discussions. A lot of Wall Street analysts we've talked to have said that the only way uh, anyone would seriously consider uh, a deal is if they can buy some or all of the assets without having to assume any of the debt. It, would the state be willing to, to eat that debt if it means offloading? The answer to that is no. The, the, the state, we're not going to ask the state taxpayers to, to pay a, a penny in, in, this, uh, in these negotiations or in any agreement. But uh, I think that the Wall Street uh, analysts and such uh, need to understand that there's a lot of interest in this, and that's why these companies are here. Uh, Sandy Cooper CEO Lonnie Carter stepped down last week, I believe. Uh, d would you call for any other Sandy Cooper leaders or anyone else that's scaled? Uh, those are decisions for those entities to make on their own. But you don't think any of them should step down immediately? Those are decisions for them to make. Did Santi Cooper tell the governor's office about the existence of the Bechtel report? Say it again. The, the Bechtel report, um, the report that they got from Bechtel, which... which uh, I missed is, the first part of your question. Did, did Santi Cooper tell the governor? Was the governor's office aware of the existence of the Bechtel report before uh, the decision to stop construction? Uh, and seeing as it's still in their possession, some lawmakers have been asking for them to share it. Uh, they're under, you know, could, could you ask Santee Cooper to, to hand it over? We've asked uh, Santee Cooper to be forthcoming with information. There are some things uh, by law or agreement they can do, some things they can't, but our intention is to get every piece of information that would be of any interest at all to the, these people, these companies who are interested in purchasing some or all of Santee Cooper or entering into any other kind of an agreement. Did you know that this report existed? I mean, it, it reportedly, yes. you know, details some of the construction problems. But did you know it existed before the, the, the decision to stop construction? Did I know it before or did it exist before? It exist, we know it existed before, but did yeah. you know that, that it was out there? No, I did not. All right, thanks, guys.